For me, it all started because I was such a huge Wallace and Gromit fan. I had loved their films, I'd longed for their autographs. And so then, when I got a letter from Nick Park asking me to be involved in this, I was absolutely delighted. I was thrilled that a lot of people had given visual contributions and I considered doing that, but I decided it would be better if I made a musical contribution. So one of the things my big band has been doing at the moment is a rather fast version of Bumble Boom based on the flight of the bumblebee. And I somehow felt that this would be a appropriate and the right sort of thing for Dear Gwinnett. The odd look for one side, the odd raised eyebrow. You can tell that there's, a, that, that, that there's an inner boogie that's waiting to get out. What's great is that an artist in Liverpool has then mashed up um, all of these th thoughts and notions and um, decorated uh, grommet, which I haven't seen yet. Oh, dear grommet. Oh, look at this marvellous musical notation. Piano keys, saxophones. Oh, this is the best grommet I've ever seen. I'm Jules Holland and this is my grommet.